Hello, my sugar plums. Welcome back to my channel. Guys, in today's DIYs, I'm going to be showing you how I transform that old beat up uh, water a bottle. This is a stainless water bottle. I got this from my sister a while ago. As you can see, it's all beat up. We have like some dent in it, but it still works perfectly fine. So I want to go ahead and give it uh, a little bit makeover. So I'm going to show you how I do that. So we're going to go ahead and jump right into the tutorial. Now I'm going to, first thing I'm going to be doing guys, I'm going to go ahead and spray paint the whole thing in black because I want to have like a fresh base to start with because you know you see the purple that it uh, started with um, had like some scratch in it like the dent and everything so we're gonna go ahead with a fresh um, start now first thing that I did guys be uh, I tried to fill up one uh, those dent the bigger one that I had um, the night before I went and mix a little bit of epoxy and put in the dent so and let it cure so that way I have a, like oh, a little bit of small um, uh, surface to work with um, like a very sm uh, flat and smooth surface because of that big dent that I have now the small little dent we're gonna try to fix them as much as we can now I'm gonna be using mica powder uh, or pigment powder to work on that uh, stainless uh, uh, still water bottle uh, just because I want to have like a very uh, opaque surface to work with instead of doing alcohol ink like I did before on the uh, champagne glass so we're gonna be using this and guys if you don't know by now purple is my favorite color all-time favorite color I'm a purple girl I love purple so I'm gonna be using most of like color that's gonna be like purple and like reddish a little bit of gold a little bit of white you know stuff like this but because the water bottle is mine you know so I'm gonna be using color that I like so uh, first thing that I, I'm gonna be doing guys as always I'm gonna be using my uh, cup turner to do that and I just went and mix a little bit of epoxy and then I went and split them into smaller um, uh, little cups those are little cups that came with um, like those medicine bottle you, um, so I split them into uh, I split uh, the epoxy in like five different one of them and then use the color that I'm gonna be using and then the little bit of clear that I have I went and added to uh, the base of the uh, water bottle and then now after I have a whole coat like of clear on top of it don't forget the uh, the bottom part also and then I'm gonna be using my heat gun to pop the bo uh, the bubbles now one thing that I did guys I did that uh, off camera is I went and added like a, 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 a painters tape at the top be because I want the top part of my bottle to be still uh, have like the, that stainless steel look because the cap itself I'm not gonna touch and I didn't want to put epoxy all the way to the top so um, I'm gonna go ahead and use uh, my colored uh, pigment epoxy and as you can see I let them sit a little bit so they can um, be a little bit thick just because I have so many dent on the bottle so I wanted to have like a thicker um, a mixture of epoxy to just try to hide them as much as possible so I'm gonna go ahead and start adding my um, my epoxy guys and all i'm doing is i'm using like the low uh stick or the low um whatever i i use to mix it i'm just using that to uh, kind of add my epoxy you know like strings um all around the bottle now there's no um right or wrong way to do this part um but you can do it uh like uh, vertically or you can do it horizontally the, the way I'm doing right now and I'm gonna be doing that and I'm gonna be adding all the colors until I'm completely done and then while the cup turner is uh, spinning what it's gonna be doing is like mixing the colors together now uh, to make sure that the color uh, mix and to give me that marbly effect that I'm looking for I'm, I'm gonna make sure to let it uh, completely spin and then mix like uh, before um, one once I'm, I'm like satisfied with the, the way it looks on the on the bottle itself all I'm gonna be doing is taking like a skewer or like anything that have like a pointy or sharp edge I'm gonna go ahead and start like doing like uh, design on my bottle now there's no um, 
right or wrong way to the design you can do swirlies it's just the way that you want your your marble effect to be showing so i'm just gonna be go ahead and do like squiggly line all from the top to the bottom and then i'm gonna be doing that until i'm satisfied with the effect that i have on the bottle now again guys you can do swirlies you can do like little circles it will just give you like a uh, some type of effect and then that's what you're gonna get in the marble uh, effect on it now once uh, you st uh, are satisfied with the effect that you have just let it keep spinning and what's gonna happen is that the epoxy is self level itself so it's gonna level everything but keep the um, the shape of like or the design that you had created with the uh, you know the line that you um, added on the epoxy itself so once I'm satisfied I'm gonna go ahead and let it spin for like four hours and then once I make sure that the epoxy is sticky it's not moving and I'm just gonna go ahead and turn off my cup turner and let the whole thing clear overnight now a little thing i did before that because i wanted to have a little bit of sparkle um into the marble effect i went and added a little bit of the uh purpley greenish glitter that i had and i also added a little bit of blue uh, of glitter as well now only added the purple uh glitter only will have like most of the purple um uh, color showing and the blue only will have the little blue effect showing i don't have a lot of them but i wanted to add a little bit of sparkle on the background and then once i finished doing that all i did was uh, left uh, the cup to uh, cure overnight and then the next morning i'm gonna go ahead with a clear coat of epoxy and put over it now i went and added two coats of the clear just because you know my cup uh, uh my water bottle is a very old water bottle it's not new so uh, you know i had all those dent and everything on it so i went and added two coats of the clear and then let it cure again for like six hours i think it was completely cured because it was super hot and then uh, once it's cured that's it we are done now guys this is one way to revamp an old water bottle or an old tumbler that you have if it's still working guys you don't need to throw it out so this is something that i did for myself so you know that's a little bit of idea i gave you guys how to just revamp something you don't always need to go and buy something new you if the one that you have is a little bit of beat up you know if it's beat up just a little bit and then you don't want to throw it out if it's still working fine then why will i throw it out so you know now i have a like uh, almost like a brand new water bottle it looks perfectly fine i use it all the time when i go out so i'm really happy with the result guys also guys i wanted to thank you so much for being here guys it's almost the end of the year i am so happy 2020 is about to go good riddance we don't need it <laughs> seriously guys 2020 have been like a roller coaster it's like oh gosh so anyway by 2020 we can't wait for that uh, year to go and so we can move on hopefully 2021 is gonna be a whole lot better but seriously guys can it get even worse i hope not <laughs> but anyway guys i hope you are doing fine both you and your family i hope you can have a very nice christmas and guys i'm gonna be posting another two videos showing you how to do like um you know some like uh last minute uh gift that you uh you can do and give to somebody so make sure you to check out those two brand new videos that i'm gonna be adding today as well guys because i want to get them out before christmas so that way you know you can have low or a little bit of time to do them and you only take like one or one day to do them like so it's very they are very 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 super easy and guys thank you so much for staying here and watching my video and if you're new guys to my channel welcome thank you so much for being here and if you haven't done so please go ahead and subscribe to my channel like this video if you do guys that will help me a lot to have youtube show my video to more people so that way more people can have a little bit of idea uh you know if they want to do something like this so just do me a favor uh click on the like button share this video with your friends and family you know subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so that will help me out a whole lot and thank you thank you thank you for all your love and support and guys that's it this is the bottle and you can see i removed the tape it's looking 
perfect i love it now it looks like i have a brand new bottle so that way guys i didn't have to throw out my old bottle plus i like it my sister gave it to me so thank you sis and this is it now i love the marbly effect that it have on the the bottle i love the color because it's like i have a lot of purple in it again and guys i'm a purple freak i love purple <laughs> <laughs> so that being said guys i hope you enjoyed this video i hope you are taking your time guys one step at a time enjoying the last little bit of 2020 we needed to get rid of it so take your time guys enjoy a little bit of happiness guys make sure again you check um the last two video i'm gonna be posting off before christmas we'll be posting more video um on the next um um on the next week um, but before christmas i'm pretty sure this is gonna be the last two video i'm gonna be posting because i'm not gonna be able to um, post anything since today's already the 23rd anyway so guys um make sure you have your notification bell on again guys thank you so much for being here uh i will be posting the two video they should be up like uh, already if not just keep an eye on them they will be up today and that's it for today guys i hope you enjoy this video i hope you learn a little bit something from it and make sure you check the other video i'll see you soon guys today bye for now and as always guys be blessed and stay blessed i love you guys bye